Welcome to the Postgraduate Diploma course in Project Management at the Department of Civil, Structural and Environmental Engineering at Trinity College Dublin. David O'Connell is my name and I'm the course director. This course is approved by Engineers Ireland for 20 hours of continuing professional development, CPD, out of an annual requirement of 35 hours for char chartered membership. This pre presentation provides co a course structure, syllabus and assessment and other relevant information about the course. So by introduction, this one-year part-time postgraduate diploma course is aimed at professionals working in the construction sector, including engineers, quantity surveyors, architects and construction managers. It's aimed at suitably qualified graduates with a good appreciation and understanding of the many different aspects involved in the management of civil engineering and construction projects, but is also relevant for the management of projects in other sectors. We have graduates from the IT sector, the pharma sector, and indeed the fashion sector study this course. The course lectures include acknowledged experts from engineering consultancies, contractors and the legal profession who are involved in managing construction projects. In terms of course organisation, the course consists of two taught modules and one coursework module. The two taught modules are spread over the two semesters and the one coursework module consists of the preparation of a research report on a topic related to project management and the use of Microsoft Project Program leading to a computer exercise. Generally, the students receive their research topics in early November and hand up their research report at the end of February or start of March. Normally, the computing exercise using MS Project 2019 is carried out over a number of weeks in March and February. The marks from the research report constitute two thirds of the assessment for the coursework module, while the marks for a computing exercise constitute one third of the coursework. Lectures are normally held on Friday evening from 7 to 10 p.m. and Saturday morning from 9.30 to 12.30 p.m. each week throughout two semesters. And indeed, the lectures are held at the museum building on campus, on the main campus in Trinity College Dublin. The schematic above shows some of the aspects covered by the course. So some of the critical components of project management include teamwork, resource scheduling, these days building information modeling and use of different types of software and also the organization and delivery of uh, projects. Our course covers all of these components and more. So in terms of more detail for the course syllabus, topics covered include project management principles and practice, IT and construction, contracts, tendering, procedures and insurances, human resource management, legal principles and legislation, health and safety, project accounting and cost control, managing projects abroad. These are just some of the topics covered and there are many subsections and subtopics under each of these main topics. So in terms of teaching methods, the teaching, teaching methods include formal lectures, small group discussions, computing exercises and individual research reports as outlined. In terms of course materials, copies of lecture notes are issued by the lecturers for each lecture. Computer software for the MS project computer component is available from the IT department at the college system. In terms of assessment and entry requirements uh, for the examination and assessment, so assessment is through a combination of the marks for two examination papers and the mark for the course work. Each paper covers one taught module. Students must pass each examination paper and each element of the course coursework. In terms of library access and resources, the library has much online material available to all students 24-7. Indeed, we have one of the best libraries in the country. The library catalogue, Stella Search, incorporates access to articles in almost 80,000 journals, along with links to the physical collection of books and journals, and gives easy access to the most current resources in all formats. Also, NSAI and BS or British Standards are available online. Entry requirements. So an honours degree level 8 on NFQI is required in engineering or another construction related discipline. A candidate with relevant experience may be interviewed to establish his or her suitability for the course at the discretion of the director. Each year prizes are awarded by Linesight to the students obtaining the three highest average marks in the diploma course. This has been going on now for a number of years. And in terms of testimonials and feedback about our course, and the course has been running now successfully 
for 40 years and is very, very well thought of across different industries, not just the construction sector. So some of the testimonials have included, I think the course is very professionally run. The lecturers are top professionals and I feel that adds a lot to the value of the course. The course content was very relevant and detailed. And last but not least, I have met a number of people who I would not have met otherwise in the industry. And that last point is very important in that many people get the opportunity to network and create links outside of their normal workplace and meet people who they would not generally have the opportunity to meet through this course. So with that, I thank you for your attention. And for any further information, including syllabus, please contact myself, David O'Connell, Course Director at the Department of Civil, Structural and Environmental Engineering, Trinity College, Dublin. Thank you. Thank you.